Yo, what's going on with ya, you two? Jumpman Chris here, we're calling back at y'all with another vid. And we got a little early, early from my guy, Hype Supply, guys. Make sure you guys check him out. If you check out his website, he gets all the heat, all the early stuff. And if you wanna use my discount code for his website, it's JMK10. Now what we have here today is gonna be probably one of the first big releases of 2024. And I'm hoping that 2024 is gonna be a much better year than 2023. We can all admit that 2023 has been kinda All right, all right, all right. Shouts to you, my guy, and voila. So you guys already know we had to start off in 2024, even though we're still in 2023. But start off in 2024 with the banger, and here it is right here. Voila, we got a yellow box, an Air Jordan 1 box, and they're still looking like they're gonna keep the theme of like, you know, the box changing. They're not, they're not gonna give us like the, the original, just black and red. They're gonna try to do some alternate colors. So I dig it, man. So, all right, here it is. Voila. And like I said, shout out to my guy, Hype Supply. Appreciate you, bro. Two wise. And here, if you wanna go ahead and scan that QR code right there, right there, that QR code right there, scan that, and you can follow him on his IG. And you go on his website and use my discount code, JMK10. All right, and here it is, here it is, and voila. Okay, never mind. Voila, check them out, check them out, check them out. Woo, what? I don't even know what these are called. Are these called Yellow Orca? And that's what I believe these things are gonna be called. And you guys tell me how you feel about these. You know what, man? I actually like Yellow, and these are not bad at all. These are actually pretty clean. And are Air Jordan 1 still dead? Is it still gonna sit? Matter of fact, I tell you what, my boy, uh, High supplier actually letting these things go for way under retail. So this might be a good time if you guys want these things, man. But you got the new buck here, new buck and tumble tumble leather. I'm digging the materials. I really am. I think these things are actually a go. These might be a go, man. Especially if you guys can get these things for retail. And if you guys still love Air Jordan 1s, these are actually pretty freaking nice. I'm not gonna lie, man. These are actually pretty clean. They're starting off in 2024 pretty right, man. Because I remember there's some other Air Jordan 1s at the beginning of the year that were kind of like, eh, you know. Already got some yellow Air Jordan 1s. You might not need these, but yeah, there's a lot of new sneaker heads out there. And maybe you guys want to just, in the, you know, there's a good color for you guys. Why not? Uh, but I already have a couple other Air Jordan 1 that are, are yellow. I mean, we got the Taxi. I guess you can call these kind of orange, but this is probably one of the best ones that came out. These came out last year. And if you guys remember the yellow pollens, like I really felt like this year, this year in particular, I think it was 2021 or 2022 or something. No, I really felt they dropped the ball on these things. You know, this is the time when they were just pumping out random Air Jordan 1 colorways. And look, I hated that leather on the yellow. I just did not like that. I feel like they would have, should have put it like this with the new buck, see? I think Jordan Brand, are they finally listening to us? Are they finally gonna give us good colorways? Are they finally gonna give us good color blocking, good materials? You know, we're supposed to get a lot of good other stuff in air in 2024 of Jordan Brand, Bread Fours, Military Fours. We got some other uh, Air Jordan Fours. We got the White Cement Threes. I mean, I'm hoping, I'm really hoping that 2024 is gonna bring us back. We're gonna bring it back to the to the to the sneaker gang, you know. Not just talking about like you know just reselling or what, but just the excitement for sneakers again, you know. I just feel like nowadays people just don't really care for sneakers. They just don't people have the love for it. There's a lot of things that kind of go with it, you know. You know, it, shoes are getting more expensive, you know, and not only that, Nike and these brands are they're starting to pump out these shoes like a lot. Like think about it, this whole month in 2023, the holiday season. We got like five shoes back to back. Like it's been crazy. We just can't keep up. We really can't. So, hey, we're just flooding it out. If you guys gotta pick one, can't buy them all, right? How you guys feel about these things, man? I mean, these definitely remind me of also of the rookie of the years. It's just one's a little darker. I love my rookie of the years. These are great, great shoe, but like a little bit lighter. 
it's kind of close. It's kind of close. I'll just say that. But stay tuned. I have like a full detailed review, especially before these things actually come out. These are set to release sometime in 2024, I believe in January. So, hey, it's a great way to start off in 2024. Hey, is Nike finally listened to us, right? Anyway, guys, um, I'm going to finish off with the video. I'm going to do this quick little unboxing here. And then, you know, I'm going to do some videos about that. Uh, I just went to the Travis Scott concert. Do a little mall vlog action about that so you guys can see. I just went to the concert. It was a great time. I, I was excited, raged out and everything. And he's also coming back to Louisville in January. So I'm thinking about might going to that show. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. Anyway, guys, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. Yo, what's going on guys? Hey, we're here in the home of the Titans, Nashville. I'm here with my sister. I have a Christmas present because uh, I wanted to go see Travis Scott. Actually, uh, it was supposed to be me and my wife, but she got sick, so I decided to give it to my sister for Christmas. We're gonna go see Travis Scott here in Nashville. Hope this is a good time. My main objective today is that we gotta get some merch, just like last time. So anyways, man, if you guys see, I got, I got on the Travis Scott Jordan, this is, I forgot which one it was. Was it the um, Air Max or, I, I forgot which merch it was. Anyways, so I got the, this, Black Taylor, the OGOs, so, hey. Anyways, we try to do some content too as well. Just enjoy the concert. Last time we, I went to see Travis Scott was in Louisville, and it was actually a good show. That was a couple years ago, before the pandemic. And I'm kind of kind of low-key upset because they didn't announce the Louisville show until like later on. So next month, Travis Scott's gonna come to Louisville. So I literally could have just waited. But it's all good. Still good. Still trying to have a good line. They are OD on the prices though. Like 50, 55 for tees. So which one do you want? What number? Let's get whatever you want. I got you. Your other birthday, Christmas. Oh yeah, birthday coming up too. So. Uh, what size is built for the, the... What size did you get? I got a large. I want a large. I get a large in the... You said the brown with the zip-up. Oh, okay. Large and see a large one. I don't know. I kind of like that one now. Which one do you like? You like this one or you like that one? Hold on. Let me see the back of it. I only like the back. This one's fire. I, really, I like that one. I want that one instead. Yeah, that's a little bit. Large and that. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So you got this one. There we go. I like this because it has the, the wording of like uh, all the cities he's been to. Uh, all the different cities. How much? Yeah, there you go, it works. There you go, Isabel. See? Sheesh. Alright, we gotta go up to this one, see if they got that long slot. What do you think about this one? I like it. I don't trust her. <laughs>
Nashville were done. Her voice is done. It was an amazing it was show, though. Birthday, Christmas present, everything. Yeah, so shout out to his sister. I got a little. It's her Christmas present. Anyways, we're done. We out, guys. Bro, that's you.